They say that necessity is the mother of invention. If you're ever in need of some cold air on a hot day in the cabin of your boat or in a tent on a camping trip or if you have an RV where the AC system has gone out, you can build one in about five minutes for about 30 bucks. Uh, this one that I'm getting ready to show you is called the Redneck Air Conditioner. The Styrofoam Cooler cost me $2.50 from Dollar General. The fan, the 12 volt fan, cost me $20 at a truck stop. And the plastic PVC fitting that acts as the vent cost me $3. And this took me five minutes of my time to make. Show it to you now. See, I'm getting some good airflow out of that. There's the cooler. Now, I do have a, an adapter to convert a house current to 12 volt. That's a cigarette lighter plug-in for the 12 volt fan, which is running. And you're saying, well, how does this make it cool? Stick some ice in there, or in this case, a frozen gallon of water. And obviously, the, uh, the more ice that you put in there, the colder it will be. If necessary, you can run this off of a 12 volt, or not even 12 volt, but a solar panel. I've got one outside that I'm getting ready to show you, and that solar panel cost me about $25 at Harbor Freight Tools. Uh, it's really easy to make. I'll show you the plans or how to do it in just a minute, but you can look it up on the internet, and it's real, real easy to do. Stand by and stay tuned. There's a lot of plans on the internet for building your own portable air conditioner, and I just finished building my own that runs completely off of solar power. Here we go. There's my solar panel hooked up to a 12 volt fan, which you put ice in there, or in my case, I like to use a frozen gallon of water so that the cooler doesn't fill with water, but it still gets cold. And it blows out and cooler is two dollars and fifty cents how cool is that right take it camping put it on your boat solar power uh, put it in your camping tent you can run that off a 12 volt uh, lawnmower battery all kind of cool stuff check it out